plenty of popular music burns up the charts one day and winds up in the bargain bin the next. But we have got with us a couple of cowboys who prove the one trend that never goes out of style are songs that are just plain kick butt. Please welcome Glenn <laughs> Campbell and Jimmy Webb. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Wow, you, two guys, you two guys have been kicking butt. Since you were little pups, now you dirty old dogs. Okay. <laughs> yeah, right. has, has the business been everything you thought it would be, Glenn? Like, uh, much more. Yeah. Yes. Uh, because when you, before you go into something, you have no concept of what it is. You know, I, all I knew, I, I wanted to play my guitar and sing, and that was it. And then, I, all of a sudden, you know, uh, TV came. You know, riding on a horse beside John Wayne. What an incredible, you know, that still seems like a fairy tale. Mm -hmm. uh, but I'm, I'm so happy to have met this man. Uh, found one of his songs. I was so homesick. I hadn't been back to Arkansas. That's where I'm from, by the way. And I, I saw uh, on the wall, uh, on the Johnny Rivers album, and he had, re it had, by the time I get to Phoenix on it, Curiosity. I said, The Bird Rising from the Ashes. Is it about Phoenix? And I got it, and I heard it, and it made me cry because I was so homesick. I want to go back to Arkansas, <laughs> see Mom and Dad. And that's what started the whole thing with Jimmy. What makes you think, Jimmy, what, why is this collaboration is so successful because it works. Mm. Every songwriter, I think, is looking for a voice. Uh, uh, Bacharach and David come to mind, and of course, their their wonderful partnership with Dion Warwick. Mm -hmm. And I think I was really lucky to find my Glenn. Uh, and uh, uh, it's it it works out in practice that I think sometimes a voice is just meant for a writer's songs, mm -hmm. and in this case. And I think we, we come from the same, uh, the same background, I mean, geolo uh, ge uh, geologically, but... You mean we, country. Country. <laughs> <laughs> but it seems like the feeling and the, you know, the way we think, you know, and the, the feelings that we have, it's, it's, they seem like they're just there. He's, he writes songs that make me cry forever, you know. I play a demo and go... <laughs> <laughs> well, you're about to play one, those... That's my job. Wichita Lineman. What was it like the first time you heard Jimmy play for you? Wichita Lineman, because that's what... I, just, I jumped up and down. I said, Jimmy, that is just so spectacular. It's got the best song I ever need lived. you more than want you, you, and I want you for all time. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a romantic sentimentalist. sentimentalist. Is that, would that be the correct word? Mm -hmm. It's close. But, yeah. <laughs> but, and I, I, did. I just said, Jimmy, that is just so incredible. I can't believe that. You've cried so much, your guitar, your guitar strings are rusted, probably. <laughs> <laughs> well, after 30 years, the guys are back together again with a new CD. Glenn Campbell reunited with wonderful Jimmy Webb. And now here they are with their classic hit, Wichita <laughs> Lineman. <laughs> small vacation but it don't look like rain and if it snows that stretch down south won't ever stand the strain and I need you more than won't you
And I need you more than want you Segment five. You're brilliant. Thank, Thank you, you so much. I appreciate it.